Hi, my name is Heinz Bieren and I would like to present you my Art of Soul project. I'm here in South Italy where the sun is shining every day. Due to this fact, I decided to produce my electrical energy needs on the roof of my house. Therefore, I installed a 3 kW peak photovoltaic plant and it's in operation since August 2012. It produced in one year at least 4500 kilowatt hours of electrical energy, enough for our needs. Monitoring the energy produced by the sun, consumed by us or fed to the grid, is the main intention of my Arduino-based project. Let's have a look how I designed this energy monitoring system. Here we have the Artosol system overview. On the left side you can see the photovoltaic plant connected to the photovoltaic inverter. Direct current is converted to alternate current. C2 is an energy meter. It meters the produced energy by the solar plant. C1 is another energy meter, meters the energy fed to the grid by the solar plant and the other hand taken from the grid into our home. Ardasol system has three main parts, three devices. The first device, the main device is the Ardasol display has to show the data and also has to deliver the data to the internet. The Ardasol monitor is the measuring device. It measures the energy flow to our house. And the Ardasol remote is an interface device. It converts the RS485 signal to a radio signal. Now let's go to more details. Ardasol display has a Arduino mega board inside. The Arduino mega board is powered on the USB port. To communicate with the both devices we have seen before, the Ardasol remote and the Ardasol energy monitor, there is an XP model which is able to communicate wireless to these two devices. A 32.16 dot matrix display, it's a Shure Electronics display, uh, has the job to display the data collected from the remote devices. An Arduino Wi-Fi shield is able to store the data on its SD card on it, and on the other hand, it is able to communicate to the router to the Xifly cloud data server. A temperature sensor measures the ambient temperature and an infrared sensor is installed to display data only when a person is in front of the display. The Ardasol remote is an interface device which has an Arduino Uno on board, also powered by the USB interface. And inside there is of course an XP module. This communicates to the display. And on the other hand, we have a RS485 converter to convert to the photovoltaic inverter. The flashing LED indicates communication between Ardasol display and photovoltaic inverter. The Ardasol monitor is the energy monitoring system. Here we have the power line 
and the power will be or let's say the current will be measured by a current transformer this current transformer <coughs> produces a signal and this signal is uh, fed to the analog digital converter in the Arduino Uno. The same thing with the grid voltage. There is a voltage transformer, a resistor network, and then also connected to the analog to digital converter. We have also a four digit seven segment display built in and also two LED bar glove display. The yellow one shows the, an analog uh, bar graph for the solar data and the red one shows the consumed energy. Also this module or this monitor has an XP inside to communicate to the Artasol display. So every 20 seconds the Artasol display gets the data from the photovoltaic inverter and from the Artasol monitor. The data will be stored on an SD card and also sent to the Xifli cloud. Let's now have a look how Artasol display and monitor is working. If someone is in front of the display, it will show the first panel indicating the ambient temperature and the time. Instant power produced, power consumed at the moment, power peak in one day, energy produced today, energy consumed and energy consumed from grid total energy produced of the solar plant, energy consumed, average energy value in one day. Merry Christmas to everybody. Now the Artasol gets new data indicating by this flashing LED. The display shows now the value of power consumed and if red and green LED is on, it shows the energy consumed in a day. 736 watts are now taken from the grid. Now the yellow bar graph shows about 1750 watts of solar energy produced and the red one shows one kilowatt of energy consumed by us. This concludes my presentation. Thank you for your attention.